What is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here, and we are playing some Rimhammer the End Times Dwarfs. Trying to get off this planet. And things are going alright. When I reloaded, we got a bunch of errors. No doubt due to 1.1 stuff. A bunch of stuff didn't respawn. But I... Hopefully they all have weapons yet. Yeah, they do. Good. <laughs> it was weapon issues. But I think it was just the Xenos weapons we had laying about. I guess we'll find out the hard way if the shit goes down here. Anyways. So we need Plasteel. Oh shit, I'm in dev mode yet. Hold on. I've been getting everything geared up for 1.1. So I've spent a lot of time lately working on dwarves in particular. Trying to get them ready for release. Which hopefully in the next day or two. Today is March 4th. I'm recorded a bit ahead. No doubt this won't land for probably a week and a half yet. But on YouTube. Anyways, we need Plasteel. Like crazy. 280. Yeah, we need a ton of it. So let's go see if we can go do some trading. Cheers to the patrons. Dirtle Dave, Corneal B, JT, Seamus, Michael Rakestraw, Wake Mata, Frederick Dappergo, Henry Wallace, Alexander, Tyronix, Typhios, and Viking. You guys are great. I very much appreciate the support. These mods take so much time, and it's such a bloody hassle. When there's an update. All right, we got a Uranium Bulgore helmet, a Plasteel table. Now that's going to get us some Plasteel. There's 12 enemies there, though. <laughs> That's a bit problematic. There's the dwarf endgame. I wish I remembered how long ago it was that I visited these dudes. We could just wait around for the mechs to attack again, but it seems like Snoozeville. Twelve enemies. I'm gonna I think we're gonna put a caravan together. We're working on armor. I'm gonna need to make a list of who I need to leave here and who I take with. Alright. So let's see if we can make something happen here. So let's sort these cats by name. We're going to leave the people that are doing the critical work. And we're going to take everybody else that we can afford to take. So Seamus, Loot, Ethan, Frederick, Alex. I don't like this weapon. I should probably switch that out, but it is what it is. Seamus, Loot, Ethan... Hopefully nobody's sick either. I guess we'll see once we get on the road. I'm going to take this guy because he's got the hand weapon. and You always want one of those guys. Alex and Henry as well. Uh, we'll take the critters because we're going to need to haul a bunch of shit back. We'll take... I don't know. What's 100 meals get us? That looks good. Going to need... Well, we might be able to just to trade off some stuff we don't want while we're out and about too. <laughs> No reason not to. This diesel. I wonder if we can fuel our equipment with diesel. Well, we'll see if we can sell it. Cloth. I'm not using a lot of cloth right now. It's good to keep some on hand. I'm going to take the hyperweave. All this stuff as well. We're definitely going to take some herbal meds. Oh shit. It's really pushing us over the limit. Let's take 50 of them. We need bed rolls. Oh, we have a potion of healing and a wand of resurrection. Three, four, five, seven bed rolls. I've got some dwarven plate that's being worked on. We have some organs. Be nice if we could take a bunch of this worn out stuff. You can really just tell by the price that it's shit. Look at that. Two thirty seven <laughs> that stuff oh it's tainted. Bloody hell, how do we get tainted stuff in here? Maybe that's just laying out in the dirt. I need to double check that. Uh, I should almost take a bunch of silver too, right? I can take a ton of it. But now we're at capacity and can't pick anything up. <laughs> Alright, what can we leave? Maybe we'll just go do the trading first. Alright, we're going to start by going there. Choose route. Accept. How long does this have? 9.9 .9 days. We should be sitting pretty. Alright, there you go. Once again, I forgot to bring all the animals in before doing that. So some, Oh, they are in. Good. They're going to gather stuff and leave. And then that will leave us just doing research. Which we only have one item left. Thanks to that tech... Oh, what's that? A meteorite of compacted machinery. Huh. I guess we'll do it. I don't really need to do it, but we will. 
And there's your raid. The cloven ones have arrived. That's two Sigor. Alright. Damn it. Here's the thing. Oh shit, are those dudes gone? They are gone. Okay, let's see if these guys can hold this off. Who's closest? JT's closest. We had to take them Sigor out. Because those dudes are going to flatten us. That is going to be a bad situation. <laughs> There's three Saigor there. That is no bueno, man. Shit. All right, I want... You guys are gone, right? Get off the freaking map. Why are you guys waiting there? There they go. Good. All right, well, it's up to the rest of us to defend ourselves here. And we got people laying around in bed. I want JT and Dom. I want the rest of you to draft up and get in here. Oh my god, we are going to get smoked. Look at them all. We missed. Look at this. Now they're going to start chucking rocks back. Look at this. Oh no. Oh god, the horror. Oh, bastards. All right, our traps are going down up there. Let's... Who's got a shitty gun? You, man, that. Oh, that's bad. Oh god, thank god it went over our heads. Alright. Here they come. They're wounded from the traps. We're gonna have somebody, some other dudes coming in here. Four bloody Saigor. Oh, there goes your assault right. Can't auto auto gun? Auto cannon. Alright, you had to get ready to start plowing shots over there. Uh, where's that headed? Don't hit Tom. Oh, ho, ho. That was a butt hair away. Get him. There you go. Take that, you son of a bitch. Hey. Oh, we wounded one. Here they come over here. Hopefully they just boogie. Saigar raids a son of a bitch. Everything's going to be beat to shit around here. Kill the son of a bitch. There he goes. All right. No sense in you shooting over there yet. Um, just shoot with this. Okay, they're done. Badass. They've had enough. Well, that could have been much more catastrophic. <laughs> Alright, good. You guys, as you were, please. And that's a bunch of stuff we can smelt for steel, which is good. I don't think the stone throwers killed a single bro. Hey, we could capture an Ungor. Abrasive, nimble, and gay. Not good stats. We don't want to bring an Ungor to space anyway. What the hell was that? Uh, you guys are still shooting? Yes, they are. <laughs> Oh, we didn't suffer too much damage. That could have been catastrophic. I saw one land over here. The dirty old dead Minotaur. Out. How are you guys doing? Oh. Well, that was... Transport pod crash, you say? Alright, what can we sell? We want to sell all this stuff. They have tons of cash. That's reducing our capacity. They have Plasteel. That pushes us over capacity, sadly. Yeah, we don't have anything else we can sell, do we? No. <laughs> Berries, packet survival meals, horses. I'm going to change the name of these horses now that horses ended up in 1.1. So the Warhammer, or Rimhammer ones are going to be War Horses. <laughs> How original, right? All right, what am I looking for? Plasteel here. Um, we might end up having to leave some food or something behind here, Plasteel. A hundred? No, we can't even afford it all anyways, so we'll just buy as much as we can and then move on. That was... Why don't we have any money? Did these jerks not load the money? Let's see, where is my silver? My silver should be showing up up here, so maybe they didn't load the money. Oh, that's all of our cash, so we might as well go to the item stash. I didn't load the silver. That's what happened. We do have this guy laying here, Vitali. He is with the brigands. He's tough. 
It's a pretty good fighter. And he's savable if we want to. I really want another dwarf, man. That's what I want. One more lad to go to space with us. And I want some couples so I can get other dwarfs as well. <laughs> That'd be nice. I think I'm... What's his gear looking like? Uh, I'm just going to let it go. And where is this tainted apparel that we had? There was some chainmail armor for dwarfs somewhere. No idea. Up oh, there. That's tainted, right? Come on. Give me some info. Yeah. So let's disallow tainted on this. Hopefully they have somewhere they can put tainted apparel. Should be able to smelt that shit down, but I don't think so. Alright, they're a day away. We have to battle 12 enemies. Now the people back home just kicked some major ass. That was a hell of a bunch of people coming in. I left Ertman here because he's a constructor. I didn't even set... Oh, I bet these just got rebuilt. Hey, they left us some silver. I gotta tweak that too. These guys probably shouldn't be carrying silver since they don't really give a shit about wealth. Got a bunch of stuff to smelt here. No one's doing any cleaning or repairs for that matter. That's kind of a snoozer right now, isn't it? <laughs> Everybody's asleep. Where's uh, Frederick's on the road? Once we get done with the research. I don't think we really need to research anything else. I got our auto cannons. This would be a really fun thing to explore sometime. Speaking of which, we were going to see if we could use that diesel to fuel something. I'm not really sure <laughs> what it would fuel. Maybe like a chem fuel reactor or something. Which you don't really need. I don't want these dirty old Ungor bows that no one's going to buy the damn things. Let's take... What the hell? Oh, there you go. Weapons. I'm going to turn Ungor bows off here too. Beastman, range, weapons, Ungor bow. Alright, so this can go somewhere. These can go somewhere. Let's go see where she puts them. Oh, I didn't even know we got attacked on this side. <laughs> Anybody make it down here? Where's she going with those bows? I have no bloody idea. Are you still carrying the bows? She put the bows down somewhere. She is so freaking fast. Maybe the bows just disappeared. I don't know. All right, we're getting traps rebuilt. If I see young or bows laying about, we'll figure it out then. A little bit of plasteel coming in. These cats are almost to their destination. Things going well for the minute. Hey, I did not want to strip this cat. I wanted him to be hauled urgently. I said I wouldn't take a bray shaman, but or a beast man, but if a bray shaman showed up, I might just take him. <laughs> I think it'd be fun. Man, we need so much plastic. I don't know how we're going to haul this shit back. We're, we might have to, like, tame a muffalo or something while we're there. Hopefully, I have one handler left here. Hopefully, or so our handlers must be on the road. Dom, do not hit a bloody trap. Thank you. Those sad wanderers, speaking of Dom. Well, he was doing a good job keeping the place tidy, and then that happened. These dudes are going to be tired and crabby when they get there. That's great. Here we go. Generating the map. Uh, zoom in. No dwarfs. It is the black brambles. I don't see any guns, any turrets around, so that's good. Yeah, let's get our horses safe. Order. No, that's a zone. Expanding. Area 1. Animals. Area 1. People. I mean, lads. No good way to get in there and shoot at them, the bastards. And we can hole up in this cave. Yeah, might as well just go over here. If you have a roof, you're less likely to be shot. Ah, these are tribals, man. Savage tribe. 
Well, Spider is going to get his ass smoked. There goes Spider. <laughs> Shoot him. Holy shit. That was three and one. Did you see that? Torso, combi plasma. Combi plasma. Okay, so the, the bolter kicks some serious ass. These dudes are boned. These weapons are a bit OP, I think, right? All right. Give it to them, boys. Let's claim some doors. And let's get down there. Let's go stand at the water's edge and smoke these last two fools. That guy's done. That is the auto cannon. <laughs> All right. There you are. Okay, so let's send Seamus over here. You have a nice long-range weapon. Are you guys still shooting? No. Okay, good. Yeah, I think we'll just claim everything here. Let's see if we can find a pack animal while we're here. Wildlife. Nope. No pack animals. That sucks. We're going to have to leave something behind. Alright, there's your items. What is that? A splinter pistol, uranium bulk or helmet. Here's our plastic table. Here, there's still more. Let's get everybody inside. They're soaking wet. That's gonna make them crabby. Ah, there's not enough beds. <laughs> Shit, we gotta see what we can carry out of here. All right, let's see if we can just reform and leave. I wonder, the table, we might just deconstruct it. It weighs 20 on its own. Oh, we can carry it. Okay, good. We'll take it. That leaves us, I don't know what we dropped along the way. The pemmican's light. Splinter pistol, we'll take that. And what else? Silver. Here it is, uranium bulgore helmet. We can smelt that down for uranium. And we can take one more thing. I don't really care. Steel spear. Two kilograms. Can we take one of these? No, we can't even take anything that's 1.1 kilogram. Alright, let's see if we can do a little more trading and then we'll go home. Alright, awesome. Yeah, those weapons kick ass. The range is too far. Nobody can compete with that shit, man. Thinking about making some more oop, beds in here. What's Ertman working on? He should just be repairing the damage done by the mighty Cygors. Here, why don't you work on this one? No, don't do that. The mighty Cygors. Which we didn't kill a single one. Hey, this guy was alive before. That's going to be a problem. Hopefully no one steps on a trap getting him out of there. Look at these two bros are watching TV. Oh, he was admiring gold. Yeah, I had to work through and get all these little things working again. Lonely grumbling. Admire gold. The end game quest. It's just a lot of work. Damn, how long has this been going on, partner? Oh, he didn't step on any traps. So that's... Or she didn't. She, is she nimble? She saw a bunch of dead bodies, I can tell you that. A body purist! Oh, man. Guess it is what it is. This better not be... Hey, you suck. Didn't I just see that Wake had that too? What did she have? Fibrous mechanites and sensory mechanites now. That's fantastic. Ah, whatever. There's going to be some breaks as the pain ramps up. Dom, if you'd come back to us, we could really use this cleaning to happen. Uh-oh. Major break risk on Dom. Oh, he just came back. At least we'll have a catharsis on him. Things will get cleaned up. Hopefully nothing important got smashed. Dirty Saigor bastards. Anybody doing the mining? It's a no. I hear some ravens. There is Doctor the Sculptor dead. 
thinking about putting the body piles over here. Been doing some offline 1.1 playthroughs. I need all these playthroughs I'm doing to get finished up so I can <laughs> start some new stuff. I don't really want to start one on the unstable branch, but mostly because you might put in 10 episodes and then it might die because the game can't hack it at that point. Let's bring these over. The Hall Urgently icon was updated, which is interesting. How are we doing for meat? We're not. What's that? We have a 16 meat. Alright, we got some bucks. A wild boar. We're not going to bother with the ravens. They get a little testy. That's a bunch of muffalo too. Hopefully they're not all in one spot. Yeah, there's two herds here. How are we doing for meals? Uh, we have 85 and 300 package survival. We're doing okay. Dudes are traveling. I guess they're going to use their bedrolls any minute now. Yeah, hopefully we can get this trade done before we end this episode. We're getting super close on the research. I don't think there's anything else that's going to help us. We could maybe... There's no armor in here. I, basic Imperial weaponry. Which... They must have tweaked that amount. The amount required for that. And then we complete... No, we didn't do it. Nice. I'm gonna, just going to say okay to that and let them go about their day then. We could do fancy big doors. We could get into blasting. We could make some of them awesome. There's no reason to do dwarven guns when we have Adeptus Imperial guns. So, yeah. Alright, they're getting the blocks brought in. You guys are bed rolling right now. Well, we're getting set. We just need the plasteel and we are freaking done, man. Well, then we have to fight these jerks off for the next 15 days. Those days usually go slow, too, because you're not able to put it in the fast mode, really, once you're getting raided nonstop. Oh, I think before we do that, we'll expand these. Caravan has arrived at Plainton. Jump to location. Trade as much plasteel as we can hold. Here, we can sell some berries. Anything else we can move here? This, we don't want that thing. Bed rolls. Mm. Let's see, we have eight of them. And... We don't have that many people. We have six people, so we could sell two of these. And we can always make more. What the hell is that? A shuriken cannon. We can't afford that, sadly. <laughs> A galvanic rifle. Dwarven weaponry. Architect eyes. All right, let's just buy as much plasteel as we can and get the hell out of here. All right, we, we have plenty of capacity. So what we're going to have to do is do some trading missions. There you go, look at that. We're buying 30. Get your butts home. Done deal. Well, anyways, cheers again to the patrons. You all got your names read off. Is everybody named after a patron? Everybody is. We got Viking to name people after. Holy shit. Let's not kill ourselves here, partners. I guess it don't matter. I mean, it does matter. <laughs> But with those weapons, they should be able to save the day. Wake is literally just hauling shit around. Why aren't we making the rest of the armor there? Steel? We're not short on steel. How about Gromrel? Do we have Gromrel? We have Gromrel right there. We still need to make shields as well. I'm going to turn Gromrel on there. How many do we have? We have nine. We needed ten. I think we're doing all right. Well, we definitely got some meat coming in, in the form of muffalo. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time when we will carry on. It's going to be muffalo revenge. I'm going to deal with that next time. I'll see you guys. Please support me. Pretty please.